What up, though? Welcome to another episode of the MMB podcast. Um, today I'm going to be dissecting or I'm going to be reviewing um, the March Day 37 Premier League results. And I'm also going to be grading and rating the seasons the Premier League team has had. But before I go into that, I would like to touch on the lack of care and lack of attention being given to racism. Especially in, especially in Spain and especially in La Liga. I think it's high time racism should be taken seriously and it's high time racism should be dealt with. They keep naming before games, they keep talking about racism, but no action seems to be taken. It's so unfortunate what happened to Vinicius over the weekend in the game against Valencia. He was being attacked, he was racially abused all through the game. And... As a man, there's there's so much you can take, but it gets to it gets to a certain level where you can't take it anymore, and you you retaliate. And funny enough, he didn't even retaliate. I don't know how he got sent off in the old scuffle, because the keeper was charging towards him after being racially abused and after after being called a monkey. The fans were chanting monkey chant towards him. It's so sad and it's so annoying that. We keep talking about racism, we, th- we keep talking about racist, but no, they don't seem to be punished. The racist guys don't seem to be punished. Yeah, you give them a stadium ban for life, but that does not mean they've been educated. That does not mean, like, racism stops in the football stadium. Like, who says they can't go out there and racially abuse people on the street? It's high time we, the government and all important bodies take racism seriously, take and be and make sure that racists are being dealt with seriously. Educate these people. Cause you can't because my skin color is different from yours doesn't mean you are better than my that's better than I am. Or I am way better than you are. You can't judge us based on this color of our skin. It's so sad to see that black men, what black men are going through all over you. And now it's so funny because or it's so annoying. It's not funny because there's nothing funny about this. It's so annoying because now it's not it's not only just Africans, it's just black generally. They generalize black generally. Whether you are a black European, whether from, whether you are from Asia, whether you are from Europe, Antarctica, Australia, as far as you are black in complexion, they demo, they demo, uh, they dehumanize you. I think it's it's high time the government, uh, FIFA at large, and the world organization at large. Start taking racism seriously and start dealing with racism. Uh, Gianni Infantino came out today, this morning, to give out a statement on the three-step processes that FIFA has created to deal with like racism among crowds or in a football game. Uh, the match should be suspended, should be stopped. Then the representatives of the of the team should come together to have a discussion and make the fans stop the noise, the racist chants. And if racist chants still persist, then the match should be suspended. And if they continue that to to continue to chant those racist those racism chants, then the opponent should be awarded the three points. I think I think that's I think that's fair. I think that's the way to go. Because until those teams until they start paying for or they start getting the consequences of action, or they start getting point uh, deducted from them, or being fined heavily with monetary fine. I think the racism will still continue, even if their team is going to be deducted point. I know the racism is still continue, but at least they know that whatever they are doing, they are putting their team in jeopardy. It's so annoying that we this is twenty twenty three and we still talk about racism. It's so annoying that. Racism still continues at this level in 2023. But I just hope and I'm appealing to all the old top organizations in the world. Please let's stop racism. Please let's take it seriously. And please let's do every single thing to stop it. And for the common man out there, please stop being a racist. It's bad. You look, it makes you look like a fool. It doesn't even make you look like a fool. You are just a fool. And you are an ignorant and you're an idiot at large so please let's stop racism